And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. That line of showers and storms continues to roll across the western and northern halves of the viewing area, rolling east-northeastward pretty slowly. In fact, only seeing a few isolated showers and storms across the far northwestern part of Tippecanoe County, but our northern counties catching a lot of these showers and storms. Now, none of these storms severe in nature quite yet, but heavy downpours, frequent lightning, maybe even sm small hail and some gusty winds associated with them at this time. But as we shift a little bit further to the southwest, I'm keeping an eye on this line of showers and storms beginning to move northeastward into parts of uh, Warren as well as uh, Fountain Counties. And as that pushes northeastward, see those storms continue to gain strength from the heat and humidity across the viewing area. Now zooming out, these showers and storms continue to develop a little bit back building. Wouldn't be surprised to see them maybe back build a little bit further into parts of central Illinois, pushing eastward in parts of central and southern Indiana over the next few hours. However, the primary threat for those showers and storms continues to be right across our region. Check out these temperatures throughout the Midwest. As warm as 91 right now in Fort Wayne, Lansing, Michigan. Much cooler off to the southeast. The rain cooled 79 degree temperature in Cincinnati. Zooming in a little bit closer to home, seeing those temperatures, the mid to low 80s. Falling off to 83 in Lafayette just a moment ago. That heat index now back down to 90, but still seeing heat indices up in the triple digits in some spots. And it's that heat and that humidity that is fueling this thunderstorm development at this time. We've hit a high temperature today in Lafayette, 88 degrees, 85 our average high temperature this time of the year. Scattered cloud cover, but staying dry downtown Lafayette at this point. That will not be the case much longer. 83 in Lafayette right now. Winds from the south, 9 miles per hour. Again, that heat index right around 90 degrees. So our future cast by 6 p.m. Eastern time, passing further off to the east. The last of the rain chances I'd like to see come to an end between 7 to 9 p.m. Now what we're looking at is showers and storms, possibly severe in nature up until about 7 p.m. or so. Then we begin to see those showers and storms weaken as we go along. The marginal risk of severe weather primarily for the southern and eastern halves of the viewing area, but pretty much encompassing the entire region this evening. The primary threats from these storms will be hail larger than an inch in diameter, but the primary threat, the main threat, will be wind gusts in excess of 60 miles per hour later this evening. Your snapshot forecast this evening, a beautiful backdrop. What's not so beautiful are those showers and storm chances throughout the evening hours. 84 by 7 p.m. falling off to around 77 degrees by 10. 75 by midnight. We bottom out at 71 in West Lafayette overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning. Now, just because we're getting done with one storm, chances mean we're done completely. Another round of showers and storms, a possibility tomorrow. I'd like to see those move in during the early afternoon hours. You can see that line pass across the far southern half of the viewing area tomorrow. Now, we're still getting this timetable nailed down, so late afternoon, early evening hours, and possibly another round of showers and storms early Thursday morning. A slight risk of severe weather for the entire viewing area tomorrow with another hot one to say the least. Temperatures reaching 89 degrees on Wednesday. Thursday back down to 86. The passing cold front finally driving those temperatures lower from 86. Thursday back down to 80 on Friday. Maybe a few light lingering showers on Friday. Then we dry out Saturday looking absolutely gorgeous. 81 mostly sunny. Chances of rainfall do return Sunday evening with our next round of low pressure warming back up to 86 by next Monday. All right, could be a busy night. Thank yeah. you very much, Cameron. Just